All right, Field School Physics. Uh, for those of you that are doing this lab in the lab, um, you're going to have the same kinds of scales that I'm showing here. Uh, I'm gonna show you two different kinds. For those of you that are doing the lab at home, uh, I've mailed you scales in a priority mail envelope that should have gotten there with some string. What you can see here is each scale has a rating. Uh, that shows the maximum amount of force it can withstand and the maximum mass you can hang from it and have it still report to you how much mass is hanging from it. Uh, the three kinds of scales that we're going to be using are 1 Newton scales, 2.5 Newton scales, and 5 Newton scales. Different ways to zero the scale. So these acrylic tube force meters have a screw piece and you turn the screw until the top reads zero newtons. Um, this one already does read that. And on these square force meters, you slide the thing that has all the marks on it so that it says zero when nothing's hanging on the scale. I actually taped a broomstick, as you see here, <clears throat> to the tops of two chairs to hang my scaffolding from and do my experiment. This. Um, so here you see I'm going to make sure I measure every piece of string that I cut to do everything that I want it to do. Uh, I taped the string here on the bottom, as you see. Um, I made sure to make note of the size of the piece of cardboard I used. I put even markings out on the thing, and uh, then I'm ready to run my experiment. I'm going to make loops of string to hold the top of the scale. See that I'm weighing the objects I'm using with the scale. I used a salt shaker in a jar. Um, I really wish I'd used a rock or something like that. It would have been easier. In fact, I almost wish I'd used a stick from my yard instead of this broomstick. It's a little bit long. Uh, if I wasn't doing this first thing in the morning, it'd be a real pain in the butt for everyone else in my family uh, to kind of get around me while I ran the experiment. It took me less than one hour from start to finish to do this experiment.